Hello everyone and welcome to Silver Hawks Let's Play. Don't touch that one, that's mine. Let's try this and see how it goes. Rawr. Okay. I can chase him again and then we do that. Yeah, yeah. I do see how you can actually use that against him. That actually works a little bit. The same thing with this as the stone statue. This one seemed to do a little bit less of damage than the other one did. I don't know, I'm probably playing this incorrectly. I know you're shouting out in the comments, Silver, for God's sake, you're playing it in the wrong way. Arr, arr, arr. I do get it a little bit. And as before, this should not be PvP. This should be me trying out the shape-shifting sta staves. Because in PvP I'll probably not use any of these. So far it feels like these aren't going to be PvP enabled dudas. Not 100% sure but... I don't see myself using these in PvP. Not at all. I don't know, maybe, maybe, baby. Haven't checked all of them yet. Let's see. Make you, new, you, 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 and then transform. Okay. Yeah, I get a lot more, uh, like, lives here. Yeah, it feels like the stone golem one. Let's do that one, then this one. The stone golem also felt a little bit like it did a little bit more damage. I'm not 100% sure. Let's try on this one, shall we? Just tanking everything, I'm not doing that out of oh my god, I'm such a noob. I'm doing it out of let's try and see how hard he hits, etc. etc. The thing is, this is probably more durable than the stone douche. That's what I felt so far. It might be that the stave is, as I said, I've learned more about staves right now, so but that shouldn't. 
shouldn't be that much difference. I don't know. One thing is certain, I'm not going to do take this one to PvP because it's not like the chase ability to run people down with it. I don't know. The Panther seems a bit cool in PvP because him you can sneak up on people. You could do it like Eve. When people are fighting other stuff you can sneak in and kill them. That's what you do with a stealth ship there, by the way. Do that, do that again. I guess it deals some damage. Yeah, I don't I don't want to go in there. It deals some damage. It's okay. Yeah, it's hard. So far Staves that I like the most are the blood, the blood dude, the wolverine guy, he was also kind of fast so you could probably run people down with him, and the panther one because you could rat with him as we call it in Eve, it's like you go in and attack people while they are doing stuff. There, I totally click the button. <laughs> right, transform. Okay, I picked up you guys. Let's see how that works. I'll run out of that. Yeah, it do, does do some damage. Yeah, I wouldn't take this into PvP. He, he does do some damage. He probably deals a little bit more damage than the Stone Golem. And uh, he does uh, take more damage than the Stone Golem, it feels like, as well. Do this. But it doesn't do as much damage as that fire imp because the fire imp had killed him by now. I feel like going with the, the panther again, except I won't be doing that during filming, of course. I'll be doing that on my own and if there's like any verdict that I will change about the panther then I'll whine about it. Of 
common one. Yeah, uh, that's that stave we say, and then we move on to this stave, and we'll push you, because you're the same. The staves are the same, basically. some healing going on there that felt a little bit like using the stave as a druid but then again then I'd just use bloody staff as a druid and heal myself and do that bullshit on the ground towards them that's just an extra step I say that after trying him once of course me and you die before I get the chance to play around <laughs> my verdicts are coming a bit too fast. The verdict of all the staffs is I won't be going PvP with them. Maybe the panther, maybe the wolf, the werewolf I meant, blood one. Don't remember what the panther was called. The bird one I don't even think about because that's like, yeah you can run away easier. Okay, what else do you have? No, you can run away easier. Smashed. Harsh. He's a lot like using a druid staff, except he's extra easy, toughament. That's a warlock. I don't want to mess with him. That was the staff I was going to go with next to try warlock. Yeah, let's fight us down there. Am I cancelling that spell? Not thinking about it. A Yorno. Yeah, well he can heal. And 
I can't play them because I'm a very bad player. Maybe they got something extra insane. Let's try that middle spell again. Push it down. I don't know what happened. It sh looked like he was shooting out roots. Maybe they can't move or something? That would be a little bit druidic kind of way as well, because he can also make people stop. Well, not make them stop, but lower their speed in which they move. Yeah, I'm gonna have to say be right back, I think, and I'm probably going to show you the Warlock Staff. So, be right back. And hello everyone. Um, yeah, I am back with the vengeance. Now, as before, I have not run around with gear that is like, oh, Silver, your gear is totally doable for going for this kind of activity because you are going to win every battle from now on because you're using these kind of sets no that's that's really not the point the point for me from the beginning was to make sure that you die no to make sure that i get a feel for the different items and feel for is this something I'd like to use in PvP, even though it is max maximum PvE, is what I'm doing right now. And as you see, I'm in a group with uh, my waifu. And uh, the reason why I'm in a group with her is because I just ran... Um, <laughs> yeah, that's, that's such a... Pew. That would be one of the reasons why I'd go PvP with this build is because I, they really die <laughs> very hard once you establish that they get like four of these on them, which is two rings, Fjonk. There we go, four. Then you slap that one on them and then you just do your thing. You can start running. That might be why Swole bend you like this. I have no clue if that's the way reason why Swole bend you like this. His, I am hundred percent sure that Swole Benji's build is not. Um, make sure you put on your mining things first. No. And yeah, uh, I'm using the uh, Adept Curse staff, and I got it times two like the other staves because it felt like a good idea seeing as I wanted to have the same kind of feeling you got that Yeah, that almost took her whole life there. Yeah, this really does damage and you can also put damage on them and then run like a crazy person. that perfect make sure that you push that ring out before you know that line out before you actually move because you're cool like that let's see does he actually take damage from those yeah he actually does doesn't he 
Damn it. I will need to make sure that I build four of them as soon as possible. Yeah, sorry, I'll stop playing around with you and just kill you instead. Yeah, this is this is what I'm talking about when I'm talking about things that I want to have in my PvP things. I know that the um, the Blood Moon set was nice because you could heal yourself with it. But if you can just damage them faster than they can heal themselves, then what what are you on about? Just do that then instead. Just kill them instead of keep them alive for longer. Are you alright when I'm stealing those? Perfection. So, Small Benji was right. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know at all. I meant, of course, Swall Benji is right. He's al almost always right, but he is some. He's got some strange going on because sometimes it's like, yeah, the best thing you can do is to go into the mist because that's the best farm you can do. Oh, is it? Then. One month later, the worst thing you can do at all is to go into the mist. Oh, so now it's the worst thing you can do. And then like a month after, the best thing you can do is to go into the mist. It's like make videos that contradict each other. I, w I don't know why you would do that. And I'm not saying that I'm contradicting myself, that I'm not contradicting myself by the stave progress that I had right now. It's not like yeah, you you showed you really show those staves what they were going for and how hard they hit silver. Good. That's the potential of stave in PvP. No, not at all. Let's slap that on and slap that in too. Then I'll just go out attack until you die. Anywho, um, I'm thinking a little bit about those weapons are actually fun weapons to have. They they do stuff like they transform you and you play around a little bit, etc., etc. With them, those are nice playthings. <laughs> I am not 100% sure that I will take them to PvP, or to PvE for that matter. Maybe the um, the Fire Imp was a nice one, because he did a lot of two two pew 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 stuff. And he, I could fly around with him at the same time, etc. etc. This guy is like... Now you both got four. Yeah, that's... It is a little bit more damage, this stave, but at the same time, let's have a peek at it, shall we? We've got this stave, that's level 13. And then we got... This stave, that's level 33. So you might think that it's a bit different. Of course, I do more damage. It's better. I have better handling on that weapon, so of course I do more damage. I don't know. Next time, I'll probably go with a bow. I wanted to try out. On my other character, when I'm playing um, uh, live playing, which I haven't done in a while again, of course, um, then I go with a bow build. And I picked up a long bow there, and I'm a bit interested to see the difference in different bows. 
and how much they do damage, etc, etc. I will most probably... There we go. Yeah, that was a totally different way than I should have done it. Should have cursed you up and then tossed that on you. Now we can put that on and run away. Oh, that's my wife. There's a yellow here. worked so nicely. It died almost directly. It's not like my wife got any thing to say about that. Mm -hmm. I just watched. Yes, she did not do any damage at all. No, yeah, I can't even start by thinking about the damage I put in that one. Run backwards and forwards. Pop it. Pew. Yeah, that, that's kind of fun. And if I've been hunting, getting hunted by a person, then I might actually put skulls on him and then run away with it. Anywho, have a nice day. Bye bye.